So, Alexi, the dog that you were walking stayed with you. Yes. I want you to walk over to there, Alexi. Walk over there to that chart. Now, I want you to point where you and Chloe came out. You came out the gate. Yes. Your dog remained with you. Yes. On which side of the street? We both walked together. No, just tell me. I'm talking about your dog. Your dog was where? There. And where was Chloe? Did you and Chloe remain on that side of the street? No. No. Chloe went where? Cross, cross. the street. Did you cross at the same time as Chloe did? Yes. So you both walked together across the street to where Mr. Bernstein was with his dog? Yes. Okay, now you can go over there. Chloe, had your dog ever had a negative interaction with Mr. Bernstein's dog before? No, Your Honor. This was the first time? Yes. Okay, Mr. Bernstein, let's go. What happened next? When I heard the back gate slam, I turned around. The larger dog was already pulling the girl, holding him across the street. When they got to the sidewalk, the girl fell. The dog at that point bit my dog on the left side. I walked the dog on the left side. So she fell? Onto the floor, on the sidewalk. Now, your mother says that you fell, Chloe. Yes. I just read your mother's answer. Yes. She said that you fell on the gravel. Yes. Step back, Mr. Bernstein. Mm -hmm. I want you to go over and show me on what gravel did you fall? I fell about right here. Right near where Mr. Bernstein was? His dog was not here. Where was his dog? They were already in the middle of the sidewalk. Okay, but that's not... I looked at the sidewalk. That's not far. We're not talking about from here to the end of the road. We're talking about a gravel path. I want to know why... Chloe, go back. Go back. You walk your dog all the time, and I assume that you don't fall all the time. Mm -hmm. And Mr. Bernstein's dog, according to you, was not near the gravel. Right. So I want you to tell me how come you fell. Because when I was running to get across the street, I heard his dog barking. And it was dark, and there was trees, and I was behind it. So once I looked over, I saw his dog, and I immediately pulled my dog the opposite way, which is what made me slip in the gravel and I fell down. And then I was pulling my dog the other way. And once I, once I was already on the ground, they were barking at each other and I'd never let go of my dog and I kept pulling my dog more and more until I could eventually get myself up. You didn't tell me you were running across the street, Alexi. Yeah. Were you running across the street? Yes. Why, Alexi? Because they had to go pee and they, they run when they have to go pee really bad. So you were both running across the street? Yes. When you were running across the street, did you hear another dog bark? Mm -hmm. Yes. And you kept running across the street? Yes. To get across. To get across. So we... To to avoid cars. Okay. Do you have a picture of the injury to your dog? Yes, I do. Chloe, was your dog injured? My dog got bit in the mouth and was bleeding. Did you take the dog to the vet? We did not. Do you have any photographs of the dog? No. Right. Can I see your vet bills, please? In the phone. Yes. You weren't there. No, but I have experienced his dog, and I just would like to share the history, if I may. Not necessary. Okay.